cats should be specially bred to lose their hunting instinct in order to preserve wildlife such as birds, an expert claims. John Bradshaw, a veterinarian scientist at Bristol University, said that selectively breeding domestic cats is possible, and would bring an end to felines bringing home dead birds and dumping them on the mat. He said domestic cats are no longer used to catch mice and have no need to hunt because they are given plentiful supplies of pet food by their owners. Dr. Bradshaw, speaking at the Cheltenham Science Festival, said, Worldwide we need a solution to cats going hunting for wildlife when they don't need to. I think we are going to have to intervene. They evolved a habit we encouraged for 10,000 years and for the last 20 years we don't want it. I think that as the planet gets more crowded, this is not an animal that can coexist with wildlife. There's precious little enough wildlife as there is, it can't share with the cat. That's not sustainable long term. Research from the Mammal Society estimate that the UK's 10 million cats catch up to 275 million animals a year as prey, of which 55 million are birds, with reptiles and amphibians such as frogs also victims of the feline slaughter. Explaining how cats could be made to be less predatory. He said, you can turn down their hunting by feeding them good food but you can't turn it off. It's too few generations since they were valued for hunting for it to disappear. The question is how we intervene, maybe by breeding? I think we should. He said that cats have been scapegoats in Australia and New Zealand for the deaths of native flightless birds and marsupials, but he added, cats are always going to be scapegoats for this kind of thing. People who don't like cats are always going to blame them. So to make that go away, we need to do something about it. We need to select for cats that don't hunt. Hunting and cats is a combination of genes and training, he said. He added, but it does seem that you can have two almost identical cats, that never really had any training in hunting, and you'll find one that never hunts, and one that is quite good at it. There is probably a genetic variation underpinning it. So you need to find where the genes are. The whole cat genome is sequenced. There are probably no more than 15 to 20 genes that differ significantly between cat and wild ancestors. It may very well be that one of those changes or a number in combination are at the root of the difference in hunting ability between the wild cat, which is a far more effective hunter, and the domestic cat. In the medium term the answer is to encourage people to breed these cats not to hunt. I think it would be a commercial product. I think you have then taken away a bit of the catness of the cat but I think that's unavoidable. We need to reserve those hunting territories for wild predators because they have nowhere else to go. Whereas our cats do have full nutrition. Other ways of preventing cats killing include fitting bells to their collars, alerting their prey, and fitting devices that emit ultra-high frequency sound, that stops cats intruding into gardens. The RSBB's position is that there is no evidence that cats are having any overall impact on the UK bird population but there is evidence that cats tend to take weak or sickly birds.